Good evening. This right here is a cancer cell. It's the scourge that's been killing people for many millennia now. However, according to this new study right here, for the first time, researchers have found a treatment that completely removed the disease in every single patient that participated, meaning that every single patient in this particular study is currently in remission with no chemo, no radiation, and no surgery. And even though the study was relatively small, well, the results are not only heartening, but also, according to the lead researcher here, they open up a potential new corridor at fighting cancer, which they will be quickly expanding to things like stomach, pancreatic, as well as bladder cancer as well. And before we dive into the actual study, if you enjoy content like this, consider taking a super quick moment to smash that like button, which will force the algorithm to share this video out to ever more people, and also consider smashing that subscribe button as well so that you can get honest coverage like this delivered to your newsfeed every single weekday. And now, let's dive into the specifics of the study. Four days ago, in a paper published within the New England Journal of Medicine, a trial involving patients suffering from advanced rectal cancer became the first in the world to completely remove the disease from every single trial participant. The study, which you can actually see up on screen for yourself, and you can also read it online for yourself if you'd like, is titled PD-1 Blockade in Mismatch Repair Deficient Locally Advanced Rectal Cancer. And the study was led by researchers over at the Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Center right here in New York, and they were testing the viability of monoclonal antibodies as a treatment for people suffering from advanced rectal cancer. Specifically, in their study group, the researchers had 12 different patients, with the median age being 54, and with 62% of them being women. And these patients were all suffering from mismatch repair deficient stage two or stage three rectal adenocarcinoma, which is a type of cancer. And normally, people with this type of cancer would have to undergo debilitating treatments, such as chemotherapy, radiation, surgery, or even in extreme cases, they would have to be fitted with colostomy bags. However, the patients in this study did not undergo any of those treatments. And instead, they were given a certain type of monoclonal antibody every three weeks for a period of six months. And according to the study findings, all of the patients experienced a complete clinical response. They went into remission and went from having advanced cancer to having no trace of tumors at all. Here's specifically what the study said, quote, a total of 12 patients have completed treatment with the Starlimab, which is the monoclonal antibody, and have undergone at least six months of follow-up. All 12 patients, 100% of them, with a 95% confidence interval, had a clinical complete response with no evidence of tumors on magnetic resonance imaging, or MRI scans. At the time of this report, no patients had received chemoradiotherapy or undergone surgery, and no cases of progression or recurrence had been reported during follow-up which ranged from six to 25 months after treatment. No adverse events of grade three or higher have been reported. Meaning that as a result of these administered monoclonal antibodies, the doctors were not able to see any tumors among 100% of the patients, which according to Dr. Andrea Sursak, who's one of the lead researchers in this trial, is something that she has never seen before. Here's specifically what she said during a recent interview over on CNN, quote, it's absolutely incredible. We, we didn't expect it. We've certainly never seen this before. It's really what cancer doctors' dreams are made of. To see a response like this, such incredible efficacy with really almost no toxicity. The patients are feeling great after the treatment with completely normal body function in something like rectal cancer, where normally other therapies are really quite toxic. So it's absolutely incredible. Then in terms of how these monoclonal antibodies actually work within a patient's body, she explained that essentially they unlock the body's ability to heal itself. Here's what the doctor said on this part, quote, so it's an immunotherapy and it works by unlocking the body's natural immune system to fight cancer. And this type of therapy works in specific cancer cells in colorectal that are mismatch repair deficient. So they lack a gene that enables them to repair their DNA. And because of that, they have many, many mutations and the immune system recognizes the cancer as form. And so when we give immunotherapy like dustrolamib, it really just revs up the immune system so that it sees the cancer and gets rid of it. But what's so remarkable here is that it completely eliminated the cancer. The tumors just vanished in all 14 consecutive patients. Normally, when this is used in colorectal cancer in patients with advanced disease, that happens in about 10% of patients. And here, it's 100%. So that's really the most striking part of this is that it happened in every single patient after just six months of therapy. Now, she did say 14 patients in that statement. She might be mistaken because the study does actually say 12 patients, or but maybe there are two patients that are not included in the study. I'm not sure about that. However, what she said regarding monoclonal antibodies is accurate, which you likely know if you happen to live in a state that was using them widely to treat COVID, like for instance, the state of Florida. These monoclonal antibodies, they're similar to the antibodies that our bodies naturally produce as a response to an infection. However, with the difference being that these monoclonal antibodies are mass produced in a laboratory. But the purpose is the same. They're meant to give the person's own immune system a boost in mounting a 
response. Furthermore, the much more exciting part of this particular study is the fact that even though the trial was limited to only rectal cancer, the researchers are planning to, as soon as possible, begin testing the same methodology on other types of cancers as well. Here's specifically what Dr. Sursek said on this front, quote, the idea here is that we move this therapy from advanced disease into early stage disease. And clearly, we're seeing that there is increased sensitivity when the tumors are in the early stage and when they are in the organ where they began. And so our goal is to replicate this in other solid tumors such as stomach cancer, pancreas cancer, and bladder cancer that are mismatch repair deficient where they have this potential sensitivity to immunotherapy. And that can have huge implications just as it did in these 14 patients where they didn't need radiation and they didn't need surgery. But we may be able to, to achieve that as well in patients with stomach cancer where surgery may not be needed if they have the same type of really remarkable response. Now, as she mentioned, there are limitations here, such as the fact that these researchers, at least at this present moment, are only looking at cancers that are caused by mismatch repair deficiency, which is when a person's cells experience mutations in these specific genes that are responsible for correcting mistakes made when the DNA is copied. And so a mismatch repair deficient cell usually has more DNA mutations, which may lead to cancer. And this is the exact type of cancer that these researchers are currently studying, at least initially. Furthermore, there is the issue of price. Because the monoclonal antibody that they're currently studying, the Strolimib, is currently sold under the brand name Gemperly. And according to Drugs.com, the cost of 10 milliliters of Gemperly is around $11,000. Now, the study said that these patients received the Strolimib treatment every three weeks for a period of six months, which, if you do the math, winds up being to nine treatments in total. However, the study did not actually mention how many milliliters were used during each treatment. However, we can imagine that the cost of this particular treatment is in the tens of thousands of dollars which would actually still make it less expensive than some of the other options that are typically recommended, such as surgery, chemotherapy, as well as radiation, and it also would have less toxic side effects. But of course, this was just an initial study, and as Dr. Sersek mentioned, they will be conducting many more studies of this treatment in the near future, so stay tuned for that. Regardless, if you'd like to read more about this particular study, I'll throw the New England Journal of Medicine link down into the description box below this video for you to check out. And all I ask in return is that if you haven't already, just take a super quick moment to smash, smash, smash that like button so that the YouTube algorithm will share this video out to ever more people. And now, sorry, do you hear the sound of a coin flipping? You're right. It's a gold coin from American Hartford Gold, my personal gold and silver bullion dealer. Listen, you already know that inflation right now is at a 40-year high, interest rates are skyrocketing, and unfortunately, it looks like we are heading straight for a recession. And so, stuck between this record inflation and a looming recession, well, our retirement accounts are in jeopardy. Now, I don't give you any financial advice, but I will tell you that I buy gold and silver, physical gold and silver, from American Hartford Gold every single month. And I would recommend that you give them a call and see what they can do for you. Because not only can they deliver this gold and silver directly to your doorstep, but they can also deposit it directly into your IRA and your 401k accounts, making the entire process super simple and protecting you from whatever comes in the future. And best of all, best of all, right now, they are running a promotional offer for our viewers, for the viewers of Facts Matter, where on your first order, they will give you up to $2,500 worth of free silver on your qualifying purchase. So calling them is an absolute no-brainer. Their phone number is 866-242-2352. That's 866-242-2352. Or you can text Roman to 655 655- They are one of the highest rated firms in the entire country. They have an A-plus rating with the Better Business Bureau, and they have quite literally tens of thousands of satisfied clients across the entire country, including me, myself. So give them a call. They're a great sponsor for this episode. And now let's head on back to the studio. And now, as I mentioned in yesterday's episode as well, we recently published a great interview, at least in my opinion, over on Epic TV between myself and Dr. Michael Yeadon, who is a former vice president over at Pfizer, as well as Pfizer's former chief scientific officer for their allergy and respiratory research department. And we discussed a broad range of topics, including how, in his professional opinion at least, there is no safe way to combat an ongoing pandemic with a vaccine, since the necessary safety trials take longer than the length of the actual pandemic. And secondly, how if we continue down the path that we've been going down, well, it will naturally lead to a total global control by a small group of elites. Now, again, as I mentioned yesterday, that interview, at least in my opinion, was fantastic. But due to the censorship regime here on YouTube, I can't even put up the the trailer for that episode. And so if you'd like to check it out for yourself, I'll throw a link to it. It'll be right there at the very top of the description box. I hope you check it out. And then until next time, I'm your host, Roman from the Epic Times. Stay informed, and most importantly, stay free.